case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The 1998 Supreme Court case, Ohio Adult Parole Authority v. Woodard, revolved around the idea that clemency decisions, which involve releasing inmates early or changing their sentences, are entirely at the governor's discretion and cannot be reviewed by the courts. Inmate Eugene Woodard argued that Ohio's clemency process violated his constitutional rights to due process and the right to remain silent. The Ohio Adult Parole Authority conducts clemency reviews, including a hearing for death row inmates. Inmates can request an interview with parole board members before the hearing, but legal counsel is not allowed. The Court of Appeals found that this voluntary interview process violated an inmate's Fifth Amendment rights. However, the Supreme Court later overturned this decision, citing the importance of the clemency process and the governor's power to grant clemency under Ohio's Constitution. In its ruling, the court determined that a voluntary inmate interview did not violate the Fifth Amendment. The process, regulated by the Ohio General Assembly, involves the authority making a recommendation to the governor, even if the inmate obtains a stay of execution. The court ultimately concluded that Ohio's clemency process did not violate an inmate's Fifth or Fourteenth Amendment rights. Defendants have the choice to remain silent during the interview, and the pressure to speak is not considered compulsion. Thus, the court overturned the Court of Appeals' decision. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.